Welcome to the National Jazz Museum in Harlem. I am Executive Director Tracy Heider Suffern, and it is my pleasure, I'm doing a happy dance, mm -hmm. to introduce to you tap dancer and MC Joseph Webb. National Jazz Museum in Harlem. I'm so grateful to be here today. Um, uh, I am a tap dancer. Um, I also brought, to, I brought along another tap dancer, um, a brilliant artist, Asha Griffith. Yes, yes, Asha Griffith. Yes, yes, yes. And also on keys, we have uh, to my right, the brilliant Sean Mason, ladies and gentlemen. Give it up for Sean Mason. Yes, and um, my brother from a different mother, uh, Lafayette Harris Jr., the other pianist tonight, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, yes, yes. And um, when we talk about tap dance, as tap dancers, um, uh, there wouldn't be any tap dance without jazz. Um, uh, tap dance is synonymous with jazz. Um, if you take a look at back at the big, big bands, um, back during the 20s, 30s, and 40s, all of them always at some point had a tap dancer, or a tap dancer traveling with them whenever they would tour. Um, so uh, you're going to see the connection, uh, the historical and modern connection between jazz and tap dance today, um, with two tap dancers um, and two pianists. And um, right now, um, Lafayette Harris and Sean Mason are going to set it off. Yep. <laughs>
that was Caravan by Duke Ellington and Juan Tizzle. <laughs> and uh, I think it's so apropos because um, Lafayette Harris, as, so, I'm, as I'm sure you all know, is actually playing the piano of master American composer and pianist Duke Ellington. And so we're going to continue in that Duke Ellington lane.
we're gonna go into um we're gonna go microphone. Thank you. Now we're gonna move on over into the lane of Thelonious Monk with straight no chaser. Yeah. Right? right? That's what's up. That's what it is. I hope you guys are enjoying yourselves. I really, really, really enjoyed that. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for Sean Mason. <laughs> Lafayette Harris Jr. Asha Griffith, ladies and gentlemen. And folks, 
I just want to I just want to say one quick thing. So sometimes you have a desire to work with people, and um, I've known Lafayette for a very very long time, over 30 years. It's been a very long time, and I've worked with Lafayette over the years, and he's one of my favorite cats to work with. And then one night I was doing a gig, and I ran into this cat, and I heard him play. I was like, Oh Lord, I gotta I gotta find some way to work with Sean. And look, here we are. And I've always wanted, I've worked, I think we've worked together, haven't we, no? I don't know. We know what we know of each other. So let's say this is our first gig working together. Yes, yes. So I just, I just want to say that I'm very grateful um, to uh, the National Jazz Museum in Harlem for providing this type of programming um, and for allowing us to come and to be creative and to be innovative and to express our art form. I just cannot explain how elated I am from what we just got finished doing. Quick question, how are we on time? We're good. Yeah, okay, good, good, okay. All right, so what we're gonna do is, so th does that good mean I need specifics? Got it, got it, yes, yes. So we're gonna, we're gonna end with a surprise tune that I'll let you know once I rap to the pianist. While Joseph is rapping to the pianists, I'm back. And I just want to say that this is the kind of wonderfulness that goes on at the National Jazz Museum in Harlem. And I want to let everyone know that this is our love letter to you. So thank you to all of you for being part of this love letter to everyone who has supported us over the past two years and everyone who has supported the National Jazz Museum in Harlem since we opened 26 years ago. Uh, I, I, this is what we do and this is who we are and it is our pleasure to be blessed by this kind of artistry and the people who come through our doors. If you don't know who we are, you should. If you do know who we are, thank you for being a part of our family.
Once again, Lafayette Harris Jr., ladies and gentlemen. Sean Mason. Asha Griffith. I'm Joseph Webb, and we are Swang for the Hard Way. So that was on Green Dolphin Street. Um, now we're going to feature Lafayette Harris Jr. and Asha Griffith. They're going to do Jitterbug Waltz. All right? Yeah. Thank you. 
So fly. Asha Griffith, ladies and gentlemen. Come on out here, Asha. Yeah, Asha Griffith, Lafayette Harris Jr. Um, this, this next selection we're going to do is going to feature Sean Mason and myself. Um, we're going to do Naima by John Coltrane. Um, the first time that I heard this ballad, I cried like a baby. Um, a good friend of mine named Mark uh, came over the crib. He's like, yo, man, you hit to that John Steps? I was like, maybe like 18, maybe. I was like, nah, not really. So he put it in. I was like, yo, man, this is really, 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 really fly. And then when Naima came on, I was like, yo, I need a minute. <laughs> I was like, yo, it just really touched me. So um, I was just telling everyone during our break that Naima is, is like my favorite ballad of all time. There's just so much love in that. So we're gonna um so we gonna vibe on that, Sean and myself. Yeah, yeah. Naima my John Coltrane. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thank you. 
Sean Mason, ladies and gentlemen. I want to say something else. I want to say Sean Mason, but we keeping this clean. So we gonna finish with Pedito by Juan Tizol as well. Another Juan Tizol tune. Yeah, yeah.
Asha Griffith, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, Asha. Lafayette Harris Jr., ladies and gentlemen. And folk, Sean Mason. Give it up for Sean Mason. And my name is Joseph Webb. We are swang for the hard way, baby. Thank you so much for joining us for this very special event. We were so happy to share it with you. If you would like to support the National Jazz Museum in Harlem, please head over to our website. Find us at www.jmih.org. Once again, that's www.jmih.org.